Hello and welcome to my empire. I'm Rep Rumor, so Total Penguin. Welcome to The Last Door, a point-and-click style horror game that is pixelated by the, th the theme, pixelated. Anyway, The Last Door. You guys have been telling me to play this game. You keep suggesting it, recommending it, whatever. And I'm, I saw this game a while ago, but I don't know why I never tried it out. It seemed interesting. And I've never played a game like this before on the channel, so I thought we could do it now. And this has gotten so many awards and just, like, good reviews. And this is episode one. This is the pilot episode. So it's free to play on the browser only. Like, it's only free to play on, on, the, on a browser, like Google Chrome or something. Press 1. Enable with disable with dyslexia. Friendly font. Oh, cool. Okay. After all the things I've seen. Okay. Oh. Oh, hey, alright. So I pick up this rope. What is this? Alright. So look at the art style. It's all pixelated and awesome. It's just a point and click. You don't need to use anything else but a mouse. So I can just sit back and relax and enjoy this game and you guys are joining with me. After all the things I've done. Okay, what's next? What what else? Oh god, I know what's gonna happen. My life is on a course that I can't escape from. Yep. It's too late for me now. No, it's never too late, buddy. You can always just try again. Just don't do it. I just hope you can forgive me someday. I will forgive you right now. Yours sincerely, Anthony Beechworth. Oh ho ho, the last door. Wow. Suicide always makes me uncomfortable, so... Developed by all these fucking names I don't know how to pronounce. Sorry. I'm not trying to attack you or anything, I just don't, I don't, I don't know. Yeah, Carlos Viola. Or Viola. Sorry, I'm gonna skip just to continue the video and keep things going. October 1891. Videt ne quisgiat. That's the only thing my dear old friend Anthony Beechworth wrote in his letter. It had been many years since I last heard that sentence. It used to be the motto of the science and philosophy group that we secretly ran back when we were in that scheduled boarding school in Scotland. We left it all behind, like simple childhood memories. But it was unusual. The letter, that letter could only mean something awful must have happened. Something that must remain absolutely secret. I had to find out what was going on. Yes, we can do this. Without delay, I took the first morning train to Sussex to the address on the letter. Or Sesu? I don't know if the X was silent. And there it was, the old ho home of Anthony's family, the Beechworth Mansion. So far, so good. Chapter 1, the letter. Alright, let's do this. I'm actually pretty excited. The story is good so far. It sucked me in. Let's do this. Okay, so I got a lens and uh, just can I look in the lens at stuff? Well, I guess not. Let's go into the house, the mansion. All right, this is weird. Everything is silent like there's no one living here. I'm worried about Anthony. I have to find him. Well, that's our plan, buddy. Okay, take off your coat. Yeah. A portrait of Anthony. He looks older than I, than I expected. Hmm. Well, I don't know how old he is, but it doesn't really matter to me. A note on the table. Dear Mr. Beechworth, due to the recent events, the situation has become unbearable for us, and, much to our regret, we have no other choice but to leave. We will remain forever grateful for all the years at your service. God bless you, Mr. and Mrs. Brewer. All right. A grandfather clock. It's the only sound around here. Okay, so there's nothing here that I can pick up or anything. So let's go... Oh, this is upstairs. No, let's go back downstairs. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, that was some menacing music. Let's go over here. Actually, let's look at the... Oh, I already looked at the clock. Let's go over here, then. Hurry! About it. Okay, so... A gramophone. It looks rusty. Probably is a drinks cabinet with glasses, some crystal bottles, and a matchbox. 
Okay. Oh. What am I gonna pick up? Only these matches could be useful. Alright, got some matches. Probably for the upstairs because it's really dark. So... A fireplace. Looks like it hasn't been cleaned in a long time. Probably not. Uh, that large window is wide open, letting the cold dusk air in. Let's go. A landscape painting. Yes, yes, a landscape painting. A crooked painting. Okay, let's enter this room here. So far, this game is pretty good. Like I said, only the first episode is free, which is why I'm playing this on the browser to see if you guys like it. And if you guys want more, I'll be more than happy to buy episodes 2, 3, and 4, which are only 99 cents, I think. So yeah. A variety of cooking ingredients. The kitchen stoves and a cleaning cloth. Yeah, oh. Yes, I got that old cloth. Good. So I can't get anything in there. Plates and uh, pans, I think that's what it said. Anything else? A plate with some days old leftovers. You hungry, buddy? You want some you want some leftovers? That's disgusting. Okay, let's see what you got in here. I unlocked the door. It was locked? I don't What the hell is that? A murder of crows is eagerly eating something. Oh gosh. It's just rubbish. So what the hell is out here? Besides crows and 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 whatnot. Let's go over here. Oh, okay. Well, let's go back inside. We'll go upstairs now. And actually, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Sorry. I don't want to miss anything, so let's go back. Let's go over here. Is there any... What happens if I... Okay. Okay. They're too vicious. So I need to get rid of these crows somehow, but let's go back. Actually, no. Let's go this way and go inside. Let's go upstairs now. We have matches, so I'm sure we can light up the area. See, look how dark it is. What is down here? Anything? Okay, okay, I got it. Let's put the match back. Let's go inside the door. Oh, one open, of course. What about this old cloth? That won't do anything. Anything? Oh. Looks like some old paintings are missing. How do you, how can you even see that? I can't see anything. Jesus. Okay, get over here. Can we not use these matches on anything? Oh, no, there's nothing in here at all. Okay, then back downstairs we go. Well then, maybe I'm, oh wait, <laughs> can I go this way? No, I can't go anywhere down, like forward into the house. Well then, let's go back over here. Oh, oh, I can clean the, yeah, all right, here we go. Yes, clean the fireplace with the cloth, got it. Would be useless. Never mind then. But if you clean it, you can put a match in it. I don't need a light up the fireplace. Why not? We need, we need some light in here. Why don't you close the window? Okay. Um. What am I missing? Oh, I didn't go this way. Did I? Oh no. Okay, I did not go this way. All right. What did you just do? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Okay. An old rosary with a solid wood crucifix. Oh, okay. I guess we'll take that. A landscape painting. Can we go down here anymore? No. Oh, we can. All right, let's go in here. Okay, what is going on? A lamp. It will come in handy. We'll take it. Do I need to put... Yeah, okay, let's see. Kerchunk. There we go. Some toiletries. Okay, some to okay, that's all toiletries. March 5th, 1891. Master made us get rid of our religious objects. What is going on with him? Luckily, I found a place to hide my rosary. I can't pry, oh, pry I can't pray every night without it. May 18th, 1891. Master has been complaining about Alfie. What would a simple cat do to him? He ordered us to keep him out of the house at all times. Still, I can't let that poor thing starve. He's such a clever cat. Every time I open the window, he knows food is waiting for him. Anyway, I'm worried about the mess master. He's growing more and more unlike himself every day. September 15th. Mr. Beechworth is spending whole days locked inside his office. He wants us to leave him food at the door, but he barely eats anything. I'm really worried. 
Uh, I don't know what the hell is going on with him, but whatever's going on, I don't know. It's, I don't know. The window won't stay open. It looks like the wood is giving up. Okay. I need some sort of card cord to keep it open. I see a little, yeah. In the wall I can see a trace of crucifix that was hanging there for years and now it's gone. Can I put it back? I'll keep the rosary with me better than leaving it there on the wall. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know. I thought maybe you didn't need it. Let's go. Okay. A small plant brings some life to this place. Yeah. Yeah. Plants are nice. You take care of those plants, you hear? Okay. It's padlocked. Well, what do we do about that? I don't know, but we have the lamp now. So we can, uh, we can go upstairs. Because we can actually see shit. Let's, let's put this on you. Equip it. No? Well, okay, then let's just go back. What is that? A stuffed deer head. Oh. Let's go upstairs now that we have this lamp so we can actually see what's going on. Ah, there we go. Okay, it got really spooky really fast. This door is locked, right? Yeah, okay, well, it just won't open. It doesn't say it's locked, but it won't open. Okay. Very carefully ease our way through here. Some wooden planks have been nailed to this doorway. Oh, gosh. Why? Why? I need to know why. Okay, let's go in here. Ah, okay, it's nice in here. It's nice. Very nice. A silver key. Take the key. Okay, now some a door was locked in this place. I don't actually remember what door it was, but it's somewhere. A double bed. It's covered in dust. Seems like no one has slept here for days. The fireplace has been hasn't been used for a long time. A gentleman with a serious and okay, none of this matters. This window leads to a balcony that communicates with the adjacent room. All right. Family portraits. So, uh, okay, I just got a key. I think that's all I'm going to find in this room. Alright, let's continue. It's locked with a key. I found it! I found the key! Oh, it doesn't fit the lock, eh? Okay, then. That is loud. The music just kicked up and it's getting loud. Some paintings are missing, yeah. What happens to the frame rate? Okay, keep going. What about this door? This door just won't open. Will the key work? Okay, no. Well then, uh, what the hell? There's something in here then that I'm not seeing or not getting. Something I missed. I think there's a door in here that's locked. It got quiet in here. Why? Okay, well, here's the ravens again. Or the crows. Rosary attack! Okay. Put it back. How about the lamp? No. How about we throw a match at him? No, I want you to do anything. Okay, so. Can we go back? Anywhere else? Oh, wait. The fields of surrounding the house stretching majestically as far as I can see. I didn't know Anthony. Okay. Well, then. Let's just go back inside. So there's something over here then. Like when we go in here, when we go down here, come on. Walk this way. Anything else when we walk further down? Oh yeah, there's a door right here, isn't there? Yeah. It's padlocked though. So, huh. there we go. Okay, it got really spooky. A slate recorded title, The Carnival of Venice. Hello? Hello? Anybody down here? Some firewood. What was that? Why don't you need a light of fire here? An iron crowbar. Take that bitch. We're gonna bust down those wooden planks. A boiler looks like it's been... Oh, let's put a match in it. Come on. 
Why don't you? Why? What? I, I need to light something with these matches other than a lamp. No, thank you. Don't make those noises at me. What is that? I don't think I checked that. What is this? Oh, a rec oh I can put a record in the, in the uh, gramophone now. Yeah, alright, let's do this. Does this guy have to walk everywhere? What if I have to run suddenly? Oh well. Okay, go back in here. And yes, put a record in there. Let's, let's play some music. Do it! Now there's the record on the gramophone, yeah! Ah! It must be broken, I don't know how to make it stop! Oh Jesus, get out of there! Okay, well I have a crowbar now, so let's go upstairs and bust down those planks, those wooden planks. Oh, or, or, or wait, this one won't budge, so let's try, wait, 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 come back. Let's try a crowbar on this door, because it won't budge. No, we just can't, okay then, go this way. Okay, here we go. Okay, we're through. For God's sakes, what happened here? I don't know. It's a letter. Dear Margaret, it's been days since Anthony left his office. I can hear him whisper angrily, frightfully, and it gets worse at night. Our servants left a few days ago. Without their help and care, I'm lost. I can barely walk out of bed. Not even the doctor would come here after his argument with Anthony. He has developed this horrible ability to break anyone's will. I don't know what to do. I don't have any strength left. I wish I could send you his letter. This letter, your dear friend. Why did the music stop? A lifeless body of a woman has been here for a few days. How do you know that? Looks like she's clutching a note in her hand. I'm writing what will surely be my final thoughts, my last lines, my last breath. I don't know what kind of dark power has turned my husband into what he is now, a stranger with a look with a look bereft of all sanity, compassion and human warmth. I don't know that shadow that slowly darkened our lives. I don't know this entity host that now dwells in our souls. I don't know where it's from, but I'm sure it is not from this world. I will meet my brothers and sisters soon. I will be free from this abyss of madness and fear. Soon I will stop trembling. Oh, okay, what was that? A hairpin. Well, might need it. So we can uh, lockpick that one door. The writing in the walls uh, reads, leave me alone. Who would have written such a thing? I don't know. An old wheelchair. Well, there's another note over here. There's a doorway right there. It's scary. A letter and a feeble handwriting. I can't go on. All is lost. Great. It's a diary page. I can't stand their stares. They watch me. They judge me. They despise me. I know they think I'm not worthy of this family. Who are they? But dust and bones. A memory. Leave me. I don't need you. Leave me alone. Well, I'm not bothering you. Nothing of interest in this dressing table. Okay. Anything else? I don't want to miss anything. Oh, I know. I don't, I don't, I don't want to read it anymore. Okay, that's it. Here we go. Okay. A woman holding a baby. She looks happy. An adult woman, she looked really... What is that noise? An old, severe-looking man. He gazes unsettlingly. What is that? A teenage girl, she has a sad face. A young man, one of Anthony's relatives. A portrait of Anthony with the stuffed lynx. It looks like he's very proud of his valued animal. The paint looks fresher around the lynx's head. 
Okay. It's weird. Um, what's going on? There's a crow behind the window. It looks like he's trying to get in. Oh, that's what I hear. That's the crow. Okay, can I... Can I let him in somehow? I, I mean, I don't know. I don't know how to let a crow in. What do I do? It would just spread out the fresh paint. Yeah, I know. Um, I don't know what to do here. Why can I go in this room if I can't do anything? Can I burn a painting? Why? His gaze unsettles me. A woman holding a babe, she looks happy. Okay, I oh, oh, this one up here. A young Anthony, just like I remember him. Just like I remember a good old Anthony out there. Okay, then let's go back. All right. There's one more door we gotta go to. It's down here. It's right here, okay. Yes, I know. Don't you dare say that's locked with a key. I got it right here. I can't force the lock with th this tough with this. What? What am I supposed to do then? It's locked with a key. All right, then I guess we go back. There's a crow knocking on the window. So my guess is the crows left. Whatever they were eating, they left it alone. So now I can go through the path again. That's my guess. I don't know. Yep. Okay. There's a dying crow amidst a pool of blood. Well, can we go pick him up? Yeah, okay. We just picked up a crow. I have no idea what we're gonna do. I have no idea what it is we're gonna do with the crow. Okay, Crow, um, I don't know what to do with you, so... Oh! Oh, God! Okay! Okay! What do I do with this Crow? I, I don't know! Well, you said you wanted to get in somewhere. Oh yeah, that just won't open. I don't know why, it just big fat won't open. Okay, let's go back in here. Crow, what do I do with you? I don't know what you want. Maybe I gotta go back into that room and put the crow down in there? I don't know. That, that was scary, though. <laughs> Come on, keep going. Keep going. Come on, man. Come on, man. Okay, the crows are gone. Why? What do I do with you, crow? I don't know what you want. What do you want, crow? You want something. Are you dead now? Okay, well, he's not dead, but he definitely doesn't sound like a crow. I don't know what to do. I really have no I idea. I have a lot of items. But what do I do with these items? I'm not sure. Let's go in here? Well, I have a crow. What do I do with the crow? I don't know. I forgot this was here. Is there something down here now? I don't know. The cement is still fresh in this wall. What do I, how do I get through that then? I don't know. I 
I'd rather not- Do I have to kill the crow? Do I do this? I don't want to stick at- Why? A rosary. I don't want to strength- Okay, this? Oh, do we burn it? Put the lamp down. Do we burn it? I don't want to burn it. Okay, an old cloth. Wipe up the blood. There's no point in cleaning the wounds. It doesn't have much time left. Oh, there's a dark- There's a hole in the wall. Let's put them in there. No, I guess not. Let's put a lamp in there. What can I do? There's a hole in the wall. I didn't even see that hole. Uh, a match. Throw a match in there. Maybe I use the old cloth on the blood? Would that do anything? I'd rather not stain it with blood. What the hell do I do then? I don't know what to do anymore. Can we burn these barrels? For some, whatever the reason is. I don't know what to do with the crow, guys. I have no idea. What do I do with you, buddy? Oh. Oh, wait, no, I read that. Okay. What do I do with you? Oh, okay, okay, I found- Okay, alright, window. Ah! Oh, here we go. Got it. Okay, now, what's going on? A stuffed lynx. Looks like the one in Anthony's portrait. Yes, yes, okay. Um, what else is going on here? <coughs> a map of the region with markings on it. Okay. A few press- A few press cuttings pinned to the wall. The Illustrated London News, 1887. Judge kills himself under strange circumstances. The Daily Telegraph, 1888. Earl found dead floating in the Thames. Damn, what? Whoa, what was that word? The Times. Famous actor found blood to death in his hotel room. Wow. The remains of chemical experiment. Some sort of spilled chemical product. A can of, th uh, what was that? A can of thinner. Okay. Uh, some strange books they've written there in, in a language I don't know. We don't need those books then. <coughs> a common hammer in good condition. Pick it up. We can use it to bust down one of those doors out there. Okay, some torn out pages. They won't bother me anymore. I'm done with their uh, senor's gazes. Oh, I'm done with their censorous gazes. Their whispers. It's already... There's only one thing left to do. Okay, yes. This is like the intro we saw. I unlocked the door. Oh, I'm back out here now. Okay, well now I have the hammer, so now I can bust through uh, the door over here. So let's do that now. Come on. Come on. Let's get to the door. Get to- th there we go. Okay. Let's hammer this bitch open. Don't even tell me that. What? Why do I have a hammer then? Maybe so I can let that crow in? Let's go. I'll let you in, buddy. No! What'd I do with thinner? Let's put it on this paint. On this painting. There's too much thinner. It would ruin the links for good. Oh, what the fuck? A sad face. Oh, uh, she looks happy. She looks really pale. Let's put some thinner on that bitch. Um... Okay, so I have thinner, a hammer, a crow. Oh, can I beat the crow to death? It's kind of mean, but can I? I'd rather not kill it like that. Okay. What about thinner? No? Okay, of course not. So then... What do I do now? There's a door way the fuck over on the other side of the house. That is something wrong with it. I don't even know what's going on anymore. Okay, my coat. Yeah, good. Um, uh, what do I do with these things? 
I don't know what it is you want me to do anymore. Maybe we pour the thinner on the blood. No, well, I don't even... Yes, I hear you! But I don't know what you want me to do! Can I walk any more this way? No, I just can't. I just can't walk any more that way. Oh, hey, look at that! Okay, I got it. The rosary will keep the window open. The window is fixed now, but why did I do that? Why did I do that? I fixed this window, but... But why? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. I just don't understand this game anymore. Maybe throw a match out. I don't know. Let's think. Okay, but why did I fix the window? Why? Oh, I, I put the crow in the... Okay, I put the crow in the bowl. The crow's in the bowl. Why did I do that? Pour thinner on him. Burn him? Okay. Old cloth. No. Why? Why did I do this thing? Is he gonna be a sacrifice for whatever comes through that window? Probably. Okay, then I guess we're done here, so... I'll see you later. Let's go back in. Nope, you're still there. I don't know what to do with you, little crow buddy. I don't know, I just put you in the bowl and I don't know what else to do with you. I don't know, but I have a hammer now. Is there something down here I need to kick their ass with this hammer? Because I will do it. Some firewood, okay. A boiler looks like, what? It's been out of use for a long time, but is there any use to anything in here? Ever. Oh wait, there's a cement wall in here I can use the hammer on. Okay, got it, let's do this. I don't want to make a mess, are you serious? What the fuck? Just bust it down. I'm getting tired of this guy's shit. You don't want to make a mess? Why? Just bust it down. Why does it matter? I'm getting tired of this guy's bullshit. Okay, okay, okay. What do I do? I hear a cat meowing in the distance. Okay. This just got kind of scary. A cat meowing in the distance? Where? I'm guessing in the in the room where the crow is. Yeah, oh my god, what are we gonna see? Oh Jesus, yeah. Where did the crow go? I don't know, look at the blood. There's a fresh trail of blood in the bowl. To that hole in the wall. The crow's gone. There's some blood left. Let's go soak up the blood in the cloth. Or not. Thinner. But thinner in it for some reason. Oh my god. What's gonna happen? This is the scariest shit ever! Now do the hammer! The cat seems to be meowing from behind this wall. The top of a chest, there's a black cat and his eyes are missing. Oh, good God, it almost ripped my eyes out. He runs to the darkness. Okay. There's an open chest with a dark cloak, a mask, and a knife. 
Only this knife can be useful. Why? I want to wear everything else. Okay, I have a knife now. Why? Oh, that fucking cat. His eyes were gone, though, it said. He didn't have eyes. Well, okay, we're fine. That cat, though, that was actually really scary. It just his meows. Meow! Meow! Okay, I have a knife. What do I do with said knife? I gotta do something with this knife. What is it that I need to do, though? I'm not too sure. But I do have a knife. That's all I know. That's all I know. I know it won't open. Let's try a knife on the door. Okay, let's try the- there's a door- oh wait, no, we opened that door. Ah, uh, what do I do with this knife then? I'm not sure. Maybe I gotta cut open this woman. No, okay. Something in here. Oh, oh, can I let this crow in? Come on, give me the knife. Give me the knife. No, okay. 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 Nothing wants to work on this knife. Okay, let's get out of here. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, music's over. This game is actually really good. I like it, even though I don't know what to do sometimes, but I still like it. It's really fun. So, yeah. Anything I can do in here? There's a... Like, this is up here. Let's go up here in the attic, because I think this is where the guy, uh, Anthony, hung himself. A reinforced metal trapdoor. There's a golden keyhole. Oh, so I need a golden key now. Okay. Now I know what I'm looking for. A golden key. Uh, okay. A stuffed lynx. Can I cut open the lynx? I don't see why I should do- Oh, I thought there'd be like a key in there or something. Well, I don't know. Maybe. Some torn out pages. Yes, I read these pages. Okay, so I can't get up there. Oh, maybe I can. Oh, damn it. Okay, I do need a golden key. <laughs> okay, of course. What am I thinking? All right, then. Okay, so what is it we're supposed to do now? I have a knife. What do I do with this knife? Huh. What do I do with thinner and, and the cloth? And, and yeah, what do I do with all this stuff? I don't understand this game. I was being an idiot. I was being a dumb dumb. You're supposed to put the paint thinner on the cloth, and now we have a wet cloth. Okay. So now what do we do with this cloth is the question, but it's what I'm going to figure out now. So I don't exactly know ex what we're going to do with the wet cloth, but we can do something. I don't know what we're going to do though. Well, since I have this wet cloth, maybe I spread the paint on the picture. Maybe that does something. Oh, it's doing something. What is it doing? The thinner has worked. The fresh paint around the lynx's head is gone now. I can see the original painting. This lynx is different. Its mouth is open as if it was growling. Okay. Why is that a thing? I don't know. But I did that now, so maybe we can cut open the lynx? Now? Or maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Ah, uh, okay, here we go. There's gonna be a golden key, isn't there? I managed to get the lynx's mouth open. The tongue has been removed. There's a golden key instead. Aha! See? Oh, I, I knew that already, but I just it wouldn't let me cut it open for some reason. Okay. Okay, here we go. I, I've, been, I've been recording for an hour. Oh, God. Oh, God, no. Anthony, no! Yes. The leftless body of my dear friend, Anthony. A portrait of Anna, Anthony's wife. It looked like those were happier times. Indeed. Uh, what do I do now? Do I burn him? No, sorry. What do I do? There's a sealed letter in his pocket. Dear J. Devitt, 
If you're reading this, the, if you're reading these lines, then I am nothing but a dead body hanging before you. I write you my last, in my last shreds of lucidity. Lucidity. Oh wait, am I Jay Devitt? I guess uh, my last shreds of lucidity. You can't possibly know how pleased I am knowing that you arrived on time. You are one of my oldest friends, and when I sent you the letter asking you to come here, I didn't doubt for one moment that you would. Had you failed me this night, everything would be lost. I have, have, I have found myself involved in a series of horrible incidents. For reasons beyond my comprehension and sanity, I have become a total stranger to myself and to my closest relatives, capable of the most in, indescribable and atrocious acts. I can't give you any more details now. I must ask you to go immediately back to the boarding school where you where we made the pact where we will we bleh, where we all said that sentence that would always protect us and swore with our honor before the other members. This letter must not reach anyone else so I'd like you to destroy it immediately. The lives of the rest of the group and yours are in great danger. Do not delay. They are already waiting for you. Seeing is believing, Devitt. Don't forget it. Always your loyal friend, Anthony Beachwood. <laughs> Ah! Yeah! Hell yeah! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, that was so good! This game is so good! That was amazing! Oh! Oh, I think that has something to do with Edgar Allan Poe's The Raven. I think that has something to do with it. Obviously, there's ravens everywhere. Oh my god. <laughs> Woo! Woo! That gets the heart pumping. That was the last door. That was chapter one. I have no idea why it took me an hour and six minutes. I've seen people beat it in like 20. But that was the last door. I hope you guys enjoyed this. It's a little, a little series I think we might start. I like it. It did really great. It had me going. I was on the edge of my seat most of the time. Uh, the puzzles, uh, I just got to think about the puzzles and I'll be able to do them. But that was the last door. If you want me to do chapter two, please tell me in the comments down below. If you like this and you want me to keep making more, if you enjoyed this and you want to watch more, please leave a like down below. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, stay frosty. See ya.